unlikely. You said it was a countess. Your aunt is great aunt. She's like a hundred. Her old man died, leaving her a million buckaroos. And she has asked you, us. Her great nephew, like legit. No to, bullshit. To move in with her? Well, not exactly. Old ladies die. What? It's natural, right? They choke on a fishbone. No! Fall down the elevator shaft. No, 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 I'm not hearing this. They slip in the subway under a roaring... You're not going to kill her. Shut, shut, shut up. No, I'm not. Of course not. Probably not. Going to? A bad lot, Alexander. A thoroughly bad lot. My friends and compatriots, I introduce my brother's unfortunate son's only child and my great nephew. Hey, cut that out. There is a familial a resemblance, Elena. And who is this ravishing little creature? <laughs> you keep your hands to yourself. This is my fiance. Fiance? Will you be lodging here also, my dear? Oh, Lordy, Lord, Helena. Don't tell me you ain't told these children. Please, follow me. I'm so sorry, great Aunt Helena. Did I accidentally trip you up there? Go ahead. I'm afraid the bedroom is no longer available to you, great nephew. What? He's back. Who? The Count. My husband, Alexander. The old rascal! <laughs> I thought he was dead. So did we all, young lady. But you can see for yourself. Darling. This is Severin's son's only child. A pussycat? He died. You, you're telling me your old man... He came back as a... I, I'm your nephew, right? That Fair and square, and that entitles me to... Uh... Oh. Genetic block. Your poor dear tortured brother, Helena. Suffered a chronic, debilitating, lifelong allergy to cats. <laughs>